Good morning guys from Rayleigh Beach, Highland, Krabi. Um, we woke up this morning and it's my birthday! So we're going for a birthday breakfast at Summer Fresh, which is just down on the beach somewhere. We're gonna go and have a walk and try and find it. But yeah, it's a beautiful day here at Rayleigh. If you're Ronan, if you want to show them what it looks like. Yeah. Pretty little birthday breakfast dress. Um, so yeah. It's pretty our, much our full, first full day in Rayleigh and it's my birthday. I'm turning 20. Woo -hoo. They can hear me. No. It's extremely windy. Oh, Ronan's has a towel here to protect the wind. Okay, I got stung by a jellyfish on my toes and the hotel poured vinegar on it and it stings like hell right now. Um, I don't really know what to do. I also have an ear infection. I'm just not really living my best life. Ronan is trying to protect me from the wind with his towel. I don't want to really show you my toes. Like, is that like weird? It's stung like on my, my big toe. I'm stung on like my big toe and the one beside my big toe. And it really hurts. I was just swimming in the ocean put my foot down and this jellyfish stings me. I don't know if you can even hear me. We've got some pad thai for lunch. Well, I did. Ronan got some shrimp spring rolls. Yeah. We're waiting for it to arrive. I don't know if you heard in the last clip, but basically I got stung by a jellyfish on my toes. Wasn't great. It feels fine now though. It's like gone. The hotel like poured vinegar on it and told me to wait for an hour and now it's like gone. So I don't know. But this hotel took really good care of me. So shout out to Rayleigh Bay Resort. Good look great care of me. Ronan has got his shrimp spring rolls. How much were they, Ronan? Mm -hmm. 100 baht. 100 baht. Mine was 80 baht. Literally no money. <laughs> uh, both that together is 180 baht, which is not even 5 euro <laughs> for lunch. And it filled me up and it was enough food. Perfect. Mm. So we have come to this place called Hawkeye. It's like on the main, I don't know if this is the main strip, but it's like all the shops and restaurants are along here. So it's a place called Hawkeye and we've come for some cocktails. It's happy hour right now. And all cocktails are 150 baht. Oh guys, so we are back. We showered. I'm in my birthday outfit. Well, it's not my birthday outfit. I just randomly picked out this outfit. Basically, it's just like a bandeau, like a pink bandeau, and then this white skirt. So we're going to this restaurant called Bansi. Bansi what? Yun. Yun? Yeah. Bansi Yun. We're first going to go to the beach and watch the sunset. Uh, Cause it's sun setting is in like by 20 minutes. So yeah, very excited. Birthday dinner. We've never walked down this strip. Obviously we've only been here about 24 hours, but this is so cool. It's full of bars and clubs and, well, not really clubs, but restaurants. That restaurant looks busy, must be good. Anywhere I see is busy, it, just, it must be good. Like that place is busy also. Okay guys, so we've actually ended up in a restaurant called, what's it called, Local Thai Food, I think it's called. Local Thai Food Restaurant, Rayleigh. Instead, because we walked over to the fancy restaurant we were gonna go to called Bu Na Thani. So we went there and there was nobody in the restaurant. And like, I'm sure it looks lovely, but I just couldn't go somewhere where it would look dead. Like it just, it looked dead. And I needed a bit of atmosphere and there's loads of people in this place. So we walked past and looked good. Food looked good. So we're gonna come here, hope for the best. So I'm gonna get the chicken gyozas to start and then I'm gonna get the green curry with chicken and sticky rice. Mmm, really good. Sticky rice is also delicious. The whole hotel, or not the hotel, the whole restaurant just sang me happy birthday <laughs> for these pancakes. So funny. Like, literally, there's just a line of people. Some of them have left. There's just a line of people singing happy birthday standing up. <laughs> Good morning guys. So we are in a restaurant called Summer Fresh. 
um, in Royal Beach and basically I didn't really vlog yesterday, we literally just chilled by the pool, we didn't really do much. But today, we're sort of doing the same thing again, <laughs> but we're over breakfast today. I got a baguette with salami and cheese. It's like the first like Western, like proper, like it looks like a real big head. Like I'm excited to eat this. We're waiting for Ronan, so I'm not, I'm waiting for him. Here is Ronan's quesadilla. It looks very, very good. And his coffee and <laughs> mine looks so boring, <laughs> but it's really good, I swear. We are currently walking down Really walking street, I actually think this street is called. And we are going to the Phra Nang beach and hoping, I think that's where the princess cave is, I'm pretty sure. So we're walking there now. It's only a 15 minute walk from our hotel pretty much, or really West Beach. Phra Nang beach is meant to be a really nice beach. And it's meant to have a cave there and it has some like shrine thing. I'll explain it when we get there. Everything looks different in the daytime. Everything is closed, all the bars. This is the pier guys, all along here. So we're basically on the opposite side of the island. The beach, Raleigh West is over there and this is Raleigh East. This is like the pier and there's a tractor in the water. Lovely. This is where the lagoon is. You have to climb literally up there. That's the climb. We're not doing that. No, see, there's the rope. Oh my God. That actually is the climb up. But we are not going to do that because that is too scary. I would freak out, so. Yeah, you're not meant to do it after rain. It has been raining, so I don't think anyone will be up there right now. And here we are at Franang Beach. Beautiful. This place is beautiful. I am so glad that we decided to come down here. This looks like just the side of one of the cliffs surrounding the island. I know the shrine is down here. I'll let you guys guess what this is a shrine for. It's exactly what you think it is. Literally, exactly what you think it is. Basically, the story was, Ronan, do you want to hear the story about this shrine? Uh, there was a woman who used to live here who was just so beautiful that no man would ever commit to her. And then she died without a man because no one, everyone was too scared because she was just so beautiful. And these are all like, what are they called? <laughs> no, not donations, but like people giving themselves to her. So yeah, it's a penis shrine. That's pretty much it to where it is. The water looks amazing. I hope there's no jellyfish in here. I'm, I'm gonna hope there is no jellyfish in here. That was amazing, no jellyfish. There's a couple of little fish, but that was amazing. Water was so clear. She was really scared of jellyfish. A little bit scared at the start. I, like, we, I felt a couple of rocks and I thought they were jellyfish, sort of freaked out, but then we're, we're okay now, we're okay. There's a lot of tourists here, not gonna lie. I would definitely recommend, if you're coming to Rayleigh, come to Fra Nang Beach. If you just put in on Google Maps, Princess Cave, it will bring you here. It's so close to everything. Like anyone can come here if you're staying in Rayleigh. I am so happy. I wish we were staying in Rayleigh for a little bit longer, but it's okay. We have come to a little restaurant called Rayleigh Family Restaurant. It was very highly recommended on TripAdvisor. So we're here for lunch. I got a red curry. Ronan has, what are they called? Wontons. Wontons, and he also has spring rolls coming. Um, so yeah, delicious lunch. Mine was only 150 baht for sticky rice and red curry. So yeah, yummy. I have had a shower and I'm a little bit burnt, as you can tell, but it's okay, it's a little bad. And I don't think it's gonna peel or anything. Like in the shower, it didn't hurt or anything. So I'm just gonna moisturize it now, hope for the best. I'm definitely a bit rosy cheeked, but <laughs> it's okay. I'm going to, I think, put my hair in braids because honestly, straightening my hair out here is just, just such a waste of time because the minute you leave the house, it's so humid that your hair just goes frizzy and it's too hot and it's like irritating your neck. Braids is just the best way to go, I'm not gonna lie. And I'm gonna wear a nice dress and I don't know what we're gonna go for dinner. There's a good Indian. It doesn't look that great from the outside but it's highly rated on TripAdvisor. TripAdvisor is just great. We find lots of restaurants in there. So yeah, we're gonna get ready for dinner. The pandas are also here by the way. The cleaner always makes the pandas look really cute and like puts them side by side in the bed. It's adorable. We are heading out for dinner. We are walking through our little jungle of a hotel. This is the Rayleigh Bay resort and spa by the way. This is where we're staying. Um, we stayed here for the past five days and it's been amazing. Highly recommend it. Ro, what do you think? Yeah, no, really nice. Really Big nice. jungle area. It all like- You feel like you're in nature a little there's bit. There's a lot of symmetry as well. It's kind of cool. <laughs> <laughs> there's two pools here. It's on the beach. Um, we chose a little bit more of an expensive room, like the little huts, but there is actual hotel rooms like in a building um, that look probably just as nice to be honest. We just like the privacy of like your own little house. Thank you. Thank you so much. Come on, guys. Well, we're at this Indian restaurant yeah. called Cohen 
Ko, Ko I Noor. I know I'm pronouncing that wrong, but that's how it's spelled. And it was highly rated on TripAdvisor, and the food looks great. And me and Ronan love an Indian, not gonna lie. He's converted me, I love Indian. So we got a butter chicken, garlic naan, and pilo rice. I'm so excited to eat it. Okay guys, I'm ending the vlog here. This is the end of the Rayleigh vlog. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, we are going to pee pee tomorrow. Uh, we have ferry at about half uh, nine. Ow. Um, I threw a panda at the camera and Ellen is now upset and said I have to end the vlog. Um, and it's almost vlog over time. Goodbye. Almost vlog over time, <laughs> goodbye.